What's good and what's up guys, let's do Jet here with some more Let's Play Paper Mario. In the last episode, we arrived at Bowser's Castle and began doing some work inside. This time, we'll be going deeper still, and yes, this was the real mistake ago. Alright, so we're going to want what? And there's a lot of enemies in here too, so you have to uh, you can either fight them and get rid of them, or you have to try and do some stuff while dealing with them. There are those guys from uh, Super Mario World. I don't know their actual name, but they're spike-based, and they're irritating, and stuff. Now the gimmick with this room is there's a lot of up and down paths, so we're gonna want to go. Uh, we're gonna want to take the paths. That's correct. And this will be a lot of switching from what to par carry. So just judge. You can you can sort of see where to go. It's actually a lot easier for me to see where to go on uh, on my little capture preview than it is uh, right here. So we have a, a path going up that way. We've uh, back. Get over me. Uh, it looks like there's nothing important. Sound. There's a, a box up there. I believe that has an item. I would go check it, but watch it uh, turn out to be like another life stream. I have four game. I don't need anymore. In fact, I feel like I feel like four is way too many. That's 40 extra uh, HP. That's a. Oh, if I'll say that's a lot shorter than I recall it. Why does Bowser have like caverns in his castle? Like, is this supposed to be a reference to um? Bowser in a Dark World and uh, Super, Mar uh, Super Mario 64. That's a really random reference to make. Okay, wait. Man, this guy's persistent. Let me alone. Kind of want him to follow me down here. Oh. Nope. Go away. Man, that guy's super persistent and super quick. Like, he wouldn't follow me all the way down there, but jeez, I'm surprised I didn't get into a battle with him. Okay. Ah. And why are these guys so adamant to get me? Okay, so there's a switch down there. In case you fall, I'm guessing. Oh. And they see you so quick, too. So I believe this is the path? Yeah. What is down here? I don't know why I did that. Ah. Go away. Oh, this is the actual way to go. What's up there, then? Stupid Magic Koopa. Yeah, if that's the actual path, then... Where's, where's this way take me? I'm, I'm curious. Nowhere. There's no item up here. Is this just supposed to be like a dead end? Like a, a ruse of sorts? Alright, so let's go ahead and take the right path. Let's do a magic Koopa. Sit in that one spot. What does this do? Oh. Open up door light. Nothing goes in here? Okay. Door light. <laughs> you came back? You escaped from the other ground jail? But there was no way you could escape. Urgh. Of all the dirty tricks, I guess I have to keep my word. You can go through, but don't think I'll forget this. I hope you won't. Be hilarious. A door holding a grudge. And so now we enter a place that I will say that... I'll probably say it pretty regularly. Alright, so if we go down this way... We see there are stairs. Obviously, we're gonna go down. That's how we're gonna get the peach. Because her castle is actually on the other side of Bowser's castle. Hey friend, how's it going? So I was thinking to cut this out, but then I was like, for one, it's kind of a required battle, and two, there's only one guy. That's like simple enough to take out. Alright, so we get it we'll get a key here so we can open this up and free the people inside. Hello, friends. So this is good because uh, this toad right here will allow us to sleep on these uh, bumps, whatever these things are called. Uh, we have all these different guys. We even have a guy from uh, Dry Dry Outpost. I would talk to them, but we're on a tight schedule here. We can't sit and dilly-dally. 
All right, so there's that uh, down there. And right, if we come up here... Look at that nice guy. I believe we come over this way. There is an item shop of sorts for us. What? Who are you, man? I don't know your face. Maybe you're Mario, huh? Just kidding. I'm the guard at this warehouse. I'm really, really bored, man. Hey, you know, if you got any coins, I'll sell you stuff. Sure. Oh, you're loaded, man. Take a look around. I'll sell you anything you see. So yeah, if you need to buy anything like a super shroom or maple syrup, this is the place to go. I, however, will hold off because I have four life shrooms. That's gonna be kind of like the, the running thing, I'm sure. Like, unnecessary amounts of, uh, insurance. Alright, so let's go ahead and continue. Whoop. 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 I, I should probably not jump, because, man, these guys are really persistent. Like, that's really irritating that Koopa Patrols could do that so quickly. Ah, this room. So we're gonna get our dear friend Sushi out. By what? Hey, Sushi. It's been a while. Okay, so there's a gimmick here that's actually really neat. I kind of like it. So there's no enemies in this room whatsoever. And we see there's a locked door right there. So let's go ahead. Oh, I actually have to aim. Oh, right, it's the red ones that manually put you up there. So grab this. And we basically drain the sewers. Well, the toilets. So this is very, this is very clean water for uh, the toilets, I guess. Bowser says, like, no pee breaks or anything. If so, man, Bowser's a jerk. Let your people go pee. But actually, not right now, because for one, I'm draining it too. Uh, I don't think Sushi would appreciate that. I don't think Mario would too. Wow, he's completely missed the door. Okay. Okay, so. We need to come over here. Hit the switch. So that we can go. Whoop, whoop. Bring back our friend Bombette. Back our dear friend Sushi. And now that we have our uh, amazing kicks, we can go ahead and maybe step on this. Man, this world has all the cool things. Uh, Herring Way had a thing where he says the gate stairs, the stairs shows up. About to switch that allows this to happen. I wish I had cool things to make like stairs and uh, corridors appear. I guess I'm not as cool as the people of the Mushroom Kingdom. Alright, so let's go ahead and make our way back. I really like this puzzle because it's, it's really neat. Uh, you get to use some of the uh, party members that you haven't used with, uh, in a while, which is really good, actually. Uh, like, I like Final Dungeons that do that, so here is the castle key. And now time to go and uh, drain everything back. I don't recall if that drains everything or just um, just the one level you put it at. I think it drains everything. Let's find out. It did not drain everything. Okay. I go back this way. Oh. I gotta wonder: Are these doors like reinforced so the fact that like the water can stay in here? Like, how does that work? I need to know. Like, these things are important to me. I would imagine they're reinforced, but then again, if uh, the walls here are weaker than uh, those of the uh, Koopa Fortress, the surprise water is spewing out into, like from Bowser's castle uh, down to the sky. So that'd be hilarious. So like that mental image, people like, oh, it's raining, and then they see like poop and stuff. I'm pretty sure that's the uh, toilet water. Oh man, this part. Uh, no, we actually went bow. Okay, so we see bullet bells are flying. What usually has bullet bells in them? Usually cannons. Alright, get closer. Alright, let's get Bombette out. Now let's go to battle with some cannons. Alright, these guys have a... Uh, these are bullet bill blasters. We fought them once prior. Um, how much defense do they have? Not a lot. Alright, Bob, but chip through that defense. They have a lot of defense. 
And you know what I have a lot of? Star Spirits! I love being able to negate defense. It's great. Uh, the Star Beam, since I was just thinking about it. I don't think it works in uh, battle. I think it's actually grayed out. Uh, since we'll be fighting some more uh, bullet bill blasters here, I'll check. Actually, wait. yeah. So let's. All right, let's take a look and see. Oh, we actually can use it. It just has like no use. It's believed. <laughs> it's believed to briefly stop Bowser's star run power. Believed. I wanna need more than that. Uh let's see. That's gonna knock down a three. Okay. I do realize that I am kinda like spamming the star spheres, but uh, in this game, I do it a bit more than, like, say, in the Thousand Year Door, because I feel stronger in the Thousand Year Door. Like, I don't know why. In this game, Mario doesn't feel as powerful. Like, yeah, he gets most of the same stuff in both games, but it just, you feel a lot stronger in, uh, the Thousand Year Door. It might be, like, because of new badges or, uh, stuff, but honestly, in this, Mario just doesn't feel like he's doing act. It wasn't all that exciting, just some, uh, reskins and bullet bills. Ooh. And there's a lot of bull bills, uh, blasters around here. I may actually have to, like, fight them. Ah! I was about to say, you better hit them. Went ahead and just cut that battle out because, honestly, it was the same fight. Uh, the only difference was there's a uh, coup patrol in there, so it was just Star Storm and then, uh, Bombad. Now, the thing is, I have FP, so I can, uh, powerbomb stuff like that. Problem is, I don't have star power, so I think these are the uh, last few. Uh... Okay, cool. So I have to let that one fire again. All right. So what I did differently that time was um, I brought Watt in instead of had I used Bombette for a little bit, then he brought Watt in. It's because Watt pierces defenses and. It's easier. Nope. Whoa, 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 whoa. Super Shroom, give me that. Was it worth it? Thank God for invincibility frames! Okay. So let's see what's going on back here. Is that another door? No, it's these guys. Same point that I will gladly take. Uh, nope. Oh. Okay, so I haven't actually shown these guys off. This is going to be a fun battle. So these are bony beetles. There are uh, dry bones here and magic Koopa. So I know what I'm taking care of first. Okay, so now that Magic Koopa's taken care of. Back. Okay, so Bony Beetles. What they can do is, uh, they, well, since they're dead and Koopas and stuff like that, they, well, are they Koopas? I think they are. They look like Koopa shells. They have a point defense, so, uh, jumping on them allows you to actually damage them. Want can natively, uh, go through defense, so. I realize I'm saying natively a lot, too. You know, I think I only said it twice. Back. Dry bones don't do much, and uh, the bony beetles also don't do much. I think they can initiate spikes. Um, I'll let Watt take care of the dry bones. Mm, yeah. Alright, that needs to stop. But yeah, uh, dry bones, all they really do is throw bones. Uh, it's not like Thousand Door where they. Uh, Rebuild people. It's weird. Oh, that's right. And uh, 
You need to finish. Uh, I think that's a thing in. Oh, that's not what I want to do. But yeah, you need to finish the battle or somehow destroy dry bones. Uh, they can be taken out to buy uh, explosions, I believe, like fire and stuff like that. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and do uh, BP. I'm gonna do that twice, and then I'll do uh, HP and FP again. Okay, sweet. Glad we got that level up because I, I really want that coin. Ah, oh, you suck. Nope. Okay, so it is like the thing over here. Oh, hey. Oh, I don't need that. I just leveled up. Okay, so what's going on in here? Oh, I know this. Alright, so we want to actually go into here. Because I think there's something worthwhile this way. Uh, oh, I, <laughs> right, I have one up. Uh, apparently, no, it's not. But I know what we need to do here. Okay, so in here. Go away. Can kind of lure you over here. Go away. Seventeen. So I did Mega Bomb uh, as well as like Star Storm to get rid of her one. It did seventeen damage to the Dry Bones. That's insane. Here's what we need, though. The castle key. Alright, I don't think the... Nope, my uh, door's not in here. That's like a few rooms back. Alright, so I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and end off right here. Uh, I know it seems like a weird stopping point, but... Uh, we did make... A lot more progress. I think we should only have like one or two more episodes inside Bowser's Castle. Uh, like the next one, we should get to the end of it. Bowser's Castle is long, um, but yeah, hopefully like one or two more episodes, and then we should hopefully be at the finale and stuff like that. So yeah, we'll be doing all that and stuff and things. So until then, I'll see you all next time.